Okay, this is a review of the Yugno RF 603N wireless triggers. Now, I'm not a fan of these wireless triggers, but these things are great for one thing and one thing only. In my opinion, two of these things together can remote trigger your camera. That's right. You hook this up to your camera and it will act as a remote shutter. Just like this, as you can see, you do need a pair of two. So let's go ahead and review. You need one of them, go ahead and turn it on, and mount it in the hot shoe of your camera, just like that, right? Okay, so now you need a cord, a sync cord, or a shutter release cord that plugs into one of the Yognos. Uh, this is the RF603N, remember? And the other end goes into your shutter release port on your camera. Now, each camera has a different shutter release port uh, connector type, so make sure you get the right one. Now, the other unit will act as the wireless shutter itself. See, all you have to do is push the button and the camera will focus on the subject like that and shoot. Boom. Let's try that again. I'll uh, mess up the uh, focus on the subject. You press the button, the camera will focus on the subject and shoot. You gotta love that, right? So let's go ahead and have some fun with this thing. Look at me, look at that. Look how handsome I am. Yes! You know I'm good, you know I look good. <laughs> so anyway, the Yugno RF603N wireless trigger, a wireless trigger, it's a wireless trigger for the flash, also a shutter release, and that's why I use these things. Um, these things are not that expensive, I mean you can buy them on Amazon for like 30 bucks for the pair. Now the one I'm reviewing, the uh, 603N, is an older unit, okay? So, cause they came out with the new version and I don't know what the new version is, but I do know this, that the new version will work just as well as the old version, which is this, the uh, 603N. So basically, just pick up some Yognos. Yognos, wireless trigger, and it's also a wireless shutter. You gotta love it. So I'll put a link in the description box below on where you could buy the Yogno wireless triggers. That's right, wireless flash triggers. That's also a wireless shutter release. But what do you use, you know, to trigger your shutters? Do you use the old-fashioned uh, shutter release cable? Or do you have a wireless shutter uh, release that you like to use that's not the Yogno's? Let's put them in the comments below and talk about it. Hey, and I want to thank you for watching this video. Uh, I'd like to thank all my subscribers. If you're not a subscriber yet, you know, please click on the link on the top right hand corner. And if you haven't seen my video on using work lights, yeah, the work lights that you, you know, buy at Home Depot in a photography studio, like 30 bucks, 40 bucks, click on that uh, video right there to the right. Thank you for watching this video. Thumbs up if you like it. I'm Dre for EMIP on EMIP TV. I'm out.